Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In this video, we'll solve end chapter problem 9.7, and this is on the request of a student. Here, we primarily will prove the Euler's theorem. So the question says that if function f, function of phi, is equal to cos phi plus j sine phi, then show that function phi is equal to e raised to the power minus j phi. So actually this amounts to saying that we have to prove that e j phi is equal to cos phi plus j sine phi, which is the Euler's theorem. So this is given from here. The first step we'll do is we'll differentiate both sides with respect to phi. So d phi uh, df phi divided by d phi and differentiation of cos phi gives minus sine phi and j sine phi gives cos phi. And now minus sine or minus 1 is actually equal to j square. So we minus 1 is replaced by j square. Then we take uh, this on the other side, take j common, and this is the function defined, so we can write it to be equal to j f phi. So, this is our uh, derivation result, and now we'll manipulate this. So, from here we have taken f phi here and d phi on the right hand side. So d f phi divided by f phi is equal to j d phi. This can also be written in this form that d phi we, we, we bring it to the side. So this will be like 1 over f phi d phi j d phi. So we were here and now we will take integral on both sides. And I'm sure you know what is the integral of 1 over x dx. It will be log natural x plus some constant c. So similarly, we can write here, this will be log natural of function f plus constant c. And this will be integral of d phi will be phi, so j into phi. Now we take c some manipulation actually here on the right hand side and minus c can be written as log natural a it could be any value and just uh, to remove your doubt I have just taken one example that log natural of 0 0.3679 is equal to minus 1 so similarly log natural of a could be taken as equal to minus c now from here we take log natural a to the left hand side and we know that log natural this minus log natural a can be written as log natural fraction that is function divided by a and this is equal to j phi and now we'll take the anti log so taking anti log this will be equal to f over a and this will become e raised to the power j phi we are taking anti log of natural log and from here f phi can be written as e, e raised to the power j phi now to find the value of a or actually this can be uh, written as this function if you remember is cos phi j sin phi so we have written it equal to this now if you put phi is equal to 0 so f 0 this will be e raised to the power 0 which is equal to 1 so this will be a and here cos 0 is 1 and sin 0 is 0 so we'll get 1 so that means a the value of a is equal to 1 so we'll put value back on the equation so we can write that this function f is equal to for a we have now put in 
वन तो ई रेस टू दी पावर माइनस जे फाइव इज इक्वल टू कॉस फाइव प्लस जे साइन फाइव इज फाइव सो दिस इज हाउ दूलर थियोरम कैन बी प्रूव तो आई होप यू हैव बीन एबल टू फॉलो थैंक यू